Also, Freeze Army, and welcome to another reactivated elusive target announcement video. My name is Mr. Freeze2244. But before we get into the video, make sure you are subscribed to the channel and hitting that bell notification to be notified of all these sort of update videos and all future videos and live streams and everything else on top of that. So, for this elusive target, it's going to be called the Bookkeeper. He's going to be taking place in Colorado. He's our second and final one that's going to be taking place in Colorado. He's elusive target number 21 that's been reactivated. And uh, what I can say about this elusive target, it's not very, um, it's not very good. He will be wandering around Colorado. It's not everyone's favorite map, but he will be wandering around all sorts of places around Colorado. But the problem is, uh, he's got like two or three guards with him at all times. And it's very difficult to isolate him by himself, unless you're super quick at the start of the mission. Now, uh, there's, there's two ways I can suggest you... Uh, go about preparing for this is at least get to mastery level six at least if you can at least get to mastery level six this will make you a lot easier for you guys and honestly it will make it tons easier if, if you get to at least mastery level six by friday it will be a lot this this friday on the 24th be available for 1 p.m uk time 2 p.m central european time and 8 a.m. Eastern time, as usual. Again, it's going to be available for 10 days. But for this one, look at a particular elusive target. It's got to be, in my opinion, one of the worst elusive targets there is. Purely because there's just a lack of uh, things you can just do with this elusive target. You can't manipulate him at all, really much. I mean, he does go to a lot of places around the map. He does eventually go into the house as well, into the basement. But trying to isolate him is is nearly impossible purely because he's got three guards with him so if you try to set up a distraction for example it's just gonna it's just gonna send the guard after it whatever you try and distract him with so uh, i recommend getting to at least mastery level six i'm gonna try and get to, I'm, I'm gonna try and do a walkthrough uh from the from the start but if that's not possible um in an easy manner i should say then i'm gonna be doing a mastery level six start playthrough of the elusive target come friday so hopefully you can understand that and you should get into mastery level six in colorado is actually relatively quite easy all you got to do is pretty much get a silent assassin suit only pretty much once and you almost unlocked it i think i'm not completely sure on that but yeah so that's your elusive target for friday it's not going to be a very good one but if it's your first elusive target in colorado you've got to be uh, but got to be very cautious and very careful because he, like i said he is surrounded by two or three guards if i remember correctly also, there is a second objective as well. You've got to retrieve a ledger that's going to be inside the house. And that's going to be inside uh, Sean Rose's room. It's going to be inside a safe, so you will need to bring at least a breach charge or a lockpick. I'm not sure who exactly has the key. I can't remember exactly. But uh, I'll give you some more advice on Friday when it comes around to getting around to doing it. So that's pretty much going to do it for this video. So thank you very much for watching. Feel free to drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you are brand new to the channel. Again, hit that bell notification to be notified of all future videos. Consider supporting me on Patreon or even becoming a member of the channel by clicking join in the options in the, in the link in the description. And I'll see you guys on Friday. Thank you so much for watching. Cheers.